don't expect instant glory. This is a step back. Malaysia is not worth our money and time. Why bother to send a team to compete in the M League when we can get better competitive matches in Singapore? By having Malaysia's under-23 playing in the S League, it will benefit them even more than having our under-23 team competing in the M League. While many Singaporeans were excited and nostalgic about Singapore rejoining the Malaysian Cup, just as many were not convinced. Razor TV invited a few hardcore local football fans to discuss Singapore's return to the Malaysian Cup after 17 years. So, uh, on Wednesday morning, Singaporeans woke up to a piece of uh, big news, and it is this. Malaysian Cup, we are back. So today we have a special discussion on uh, rejoining the Malaysian Cup, and today we have with me Hang Gyeong from My Paper, Arif, who is a uh, Tampines uh, fan, Daniel, Home United, and Mervin, an Aokang fan. That's yeah. right. Off the bat, rejoining this uh, Malaysian Cup, how do you all feel? We, we need to not, not make a big fuss and say, oh, it's back to the Kalang, go days of the Kalang Raw, 50,000 crowd, everything again, because it, it is going to build slowly. It's, it's, we, we, we haven't had that right. for about 17 years already. Since 1994, so it's gonna take a while for them to build up that kind of, you know, everybody will go to the, the state stadium and on 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 to support Singapore versus Malaysia. Mm -hmm. and, and week 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 in week out, it's gonna take a while, and it's gonna take a lot of winning to do so. But the drawbacks is also a lot, okay, especially in terms of um, the S League right now. Are we gonna take away you know, the interest in the S League? Mm -hmm. I mean, I'm not too sure. But personal on a personal point of view, as a fan. As a fan, I do hope that, you know, at the end of the day, the decision has been made. We as fans, let's try to, you know, help help, help this whole situation and make it work in our favour. Like you said, it's all about the future. So, it's too early to tell now whether this move is going to mm. be a good one or a bad one. We shall see how it goes. But most importantly, we have to show our support because this move has been made. This move by FAS, like what Arif has said, um, at least got... Uh, people talking again. Um, it got people saying, ooh, wow, there's something new for Singapore football. Uh, oh, s -League has gone on, same format, changed a little format, didn't work out. Um, fans are staying away, except a few hardcore ones. And suddenly, oh, there's something new. So, you know, I th I'm probably one of those, what I call my, uh, one of the 70% who's in favour of it. Have you guys heard anything about uh, the fans yeah, in Singapore. I think it this decision has you know divide us. I mean across the board, there are some who think that you know it's a good move you know, and there are those that are really <coughs> against it. Um, I mean if you are, if you look at everyone's perspective, they they have valid points. Yes, they are concerned good. about the S League, the current state of the S League. As it is, you know, people are saying why 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 can't the FAS you know invest more on the S League? Think about the S League first, this and that. But on the other hand, there are fans who like what Mervin said, you know, are dreaming about the nostalgic feeling, this uh, pride for the pride that you have for the country. So it really splits splits the fan down the middle. My question is, what if one day? Uh, there's a fixture that Lions will play Selangor and Haugang United at the very same time is uh, slated to play against uh, it play in the S-League that night so who am I going to support? I want to support both but this is a conundrum that has to be solved Do you feel that the Malaysian Tigers will help improve the standard of the teams the S-League teams? It will help to you know uh, ignite the rivalry but if you are talking about um, Standards, yeah, standards, technical standards. Technical standards. I don't think so. Hmm. Okay, why, why don't you? Why don't you think so? Do you think the, the the Malaysian team is too weak to help push the Singapore teams? Mm, because I think Singapore football, in terms of the S League clubs, should be better than Malaysia. The 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 problem with this is, the we need to fi somehow find a balance between, um, um, supporting both the S League and this. Singapore under twenty three teams that's going into the Malaysian Super sure. League. Do we have do 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 the local uh, football community have uh, the resources and everything to both uh, keep S League afloat uh, and at the same time uh, generate interest in that under twenty three team? It is a tall task. It's not easy. In the next clip, we dissect the H.O. rivalry between Singapore and its neighbour from across the causeway.